Hello everyone, my name is Andrea and welcome to my channel. It's about handbags, lifestyle reviews, and unboxings. If you're interested in that, subscribe to my channel. Want to welcome you into the Babe Cave. And today's video is Accessory August is the hashtag this month and I have so many accessories, I didn't know how to go about this, but the way I'm doing it is I'm going to do um, my, my Dooney and Burke accessories, and so yeah, that's what I'm going to start with is Dooney accessories August. So let's get started, but first, bag of the day, <laughs> again I am in my denim soft tabby. When I did my favorites video, I decided I needed to go back in into this bag again because it is that good and well made, beautiful, fits all my essentials. I wore it as a crossbody this time and so yeah. Coach soft denim tabby amazing. So on to the accessories of Dooney. I'm going to start off with the large framed kiss lock. I only brought out the one but I have three or four other ones and this is probably the one I use the most. It is really pretty coated shiny kind of canvas. The DB 1975 gold hardware I don't use the credit card slots. Typically, this is like a, my lipsticks and chapsticks and Vicks. Uh, but you can use it as a wallet, as you can see. And it's just cute. It's a very cute kiss lock coin purse that... If you don't have one of these, you need at least one, in my opinion, of these large framed kiss locks. They're just so cute and... They're pretty slim for your bag. I mean, I wouldn't put it in a small bag or a mini, of course. But So that's the first item, the large framed Kiss Lock. I only have one cosmetic bag, and I use this constantly. This is the Americana collection that they came out with I don't know how long ago. I just got this off the secondhand market. It's such a cool piece. And you don't see a lot of these roaming around on the secondhand market. So I snatched it up. I love all of the landmarks. And uh, I'm in Missouri. So I like that there's the arch. Super cute. It holds a lot of your accessories or cosmetics if you want to use it for anything you can use it for anything it has the corner with the brown leather here is the tag and yeah so that is my one and only cosmetic bag next i want to show you my uh bag charm of the duck the chubby duck i got this years ago i kept seeing it on different youtube channels and I thought, you know what, I need this. I love Dooney, and so I probably got it for 20 or 30 bucks. They still sell these on I Love Dooney, I believe. If you don't have one, they are so cute on a Dooney bag. So definitely get you one of these bag charms. Next is the small coin case in Florentine leather, and this is the color navy. I really like that they put this stitching here. This little piece right here has the back pocket, a front zipper, and then the middle zipper in which you can put your keys inside if you choose to, or credit cards or gift cards. It's it's very handy to have one of these little coin pouches. Or Mine's a little scratched up, so if you do get Florentine leather... And you put it inside your bag, you're bound to get scratches. So that's the warning of SLGs that are Florentine. They will get scratched, but it has been a great piece. 
and I have that one. And then if you don't want all the scratches, well, you'll get scratches on this gold plate <laughs> if you... So you got to choose which one do you want the scratches here or on the leather. Both are fabulous pieces. Um, this one, of course, is in pebbled leather, black, and I picked black and brown because I just think that goes with everything anyway. Same setup as the other one, just pebbled le soft leather. It's a great piece to have. Just be aware there will be scratches and there will be scratches. <laughs> But it's inside your bag, and I change out a lot, so I don't try to use them constantly. I try to rotate them out. And then I have, which I'm not showing my whole collection. I'm just kind of pointing out some good pieces to have. And this is like a, a wristlet that I don't like when they have the wristlets on in my bag. I just, I don't use them like that, so... This one's really cool with the all the colors and the little duck. My favorite part is this rainbow zipper. I wish they would bring a bag back and put this cool rainbow zipper back on. It's so neat. So yeah, this is just a little pouch. You also can put your keys on it as well. Oh, look. I think this was my daughter's little ice cream cone. <laughs> but yeah, this is a good little piece to have for your Dooney and Burke accessory. And this one, I also have it in a black multicolor. It came with my uh, crossbody bag. But this one's the older one with, of course, the rainbow coloring on the... And I just wanted to show you the difference in the colors that are on these. The black one seems to be darker. I don't know if this is worn off or if this was really meant to be lighter on the zipper, but it's so cute. So yeah, get you a couple of these. They're very handy. This one is like this plastic type material, wipeable material, and there is no key thing in it to hang your keys on, but you can always throw them inside. So these are great little catch-all pieces. Next is another bag charm, and I think they still sell these, and mine is in this blue. I think they had a pink one as well, and I picked the blue. This is basically if you get your car valeted, you just, you just turn this, and it unlocks right here, and you give your valet this key. So you have your keys, if you have your house keys on this one, you keep that and give them this. So that's really handy if you do valet your car ever. And it's just a little lock like that. And it's a bag charm as well. So it's pretty neat. Keychain, bag charm, valet parking, you know. It's, it's multi-use here. This next one is a recent purchase. And I did keep the box for it. I just thought it was, if you buy a wallet, a bigger size wallet or one like this one, you usually get these boxes with them. And this is my newest, I believe, is my fuchsia colored Florentine small zip around wallet. This is another piece that everyone recommends and so do I. <laughs> you put your coins in the back. You can put your receipts or your card in the front if you want. Zip around. It opens wide. You can put your bills straight inside. Lots of card slots. If you don't have any of these small zip around wallets, I would grab one. And this is, of course, the Florentine leather in the color fuchsia. So pretty. And lots of card slots. This is a, a must-have in my Dooney collection, so I may get another one. I don't know, but I'm not doing it this year. Maybe next year I'll get another color. So that's that one. And this one I purchased several years ago. And look at the boxes are different. They changed it up a little bit from... This is an older purchase. And it came in here. And I wanted to show you that. This is called the Large Zip Around Credit Card Case in Red. And I don't know why it's large because it's not really large. <laughs> and 
And I paid $11.82 for this wallet. And that is back in the time where they had loyalty points. And I only paid $11.82 for this really pretty red wallet. So I had to show you that. And here's the name of the wallet. So you believe me, I paid that much. <laughs> but yeah, I miss those loyalty points where you, after so many purchases, you, you know, of course got points. And they did away with those. But anyway, let me show you the inside of this it's very, you know, limited on, you got two slots over there, two slots over there and a middle zip, and then these two compartments. And that's all there is to that one. <laughs> this isn't my favorite wallet. I have used it, but it's definitely not large. I don't, I don't know why they call it large, but <laughs> so basically it holds your, all your cards, so... That is my final piece that I'm showing on this accessory August. But yeah, I don't usually keep boxes, but I had to. So I'm just going to show you all my pieces up here. Tell me what accessories you have from Dooney or if I need some more accessories that you think I need. Tell me down below. <laughs> <laughs> but these are what I have for right now. And I think they're pretty good staples to have in your collection. Sorry my finger was in that. <laughs> anyway, thank you for watching. And don't forget to hit the thumbs up for Accessory August. And I know this was uh, a tag or hashtag from Ola May. I will put her down below. So go subscribe to her channel and subscribe to my channel and uh thank you for watching the Dooney and Burke accessories that I have which like I said I didn't put everything out that I have but I'm not going to show multiples and I did just because of the different leathers on that one so that is all I have for you today thank you for watching and I'll talk to you soon bye